Yeah. All right. So we're here in Istanbul and I'm standing in front of probably one of the most well-known monuments in Istanbul. It's the Blue Mosque. Um, and just down the road over that way is another one of the more well-known monuments. It's the Hagia Sophia. Uh, but today I want to talk about probably my favorite site in all of Istanbul because I feel like it doesn't get the attention it deserves and it sort of doesn't really stand out amongst these monumental structures. So what we're going to do is we're going to come right around this way. What we're looking at is right behind me. It's the serpentine column. You'll see that this serpentine column stands in between two massive obelisks. There's one over here as well. And this one. But we're looking at this guy right here. What is the serpentine column? Serpentine column is an ancient structure. I mean, everyone from Herodotus and Thucydides, I mean, the, the fathers of modern history, uh, Edward Gibbon, they've all written about this column. And why it's important is because this column was created um, to celebrate a great victory of the Greek uh, city-states over the Persians after the Battle of Plataea. And they took all of the Persian weaponry, melted it down, created this uh, column right here. Uh, you might say, like, why is it here in Istanbul? Uh, the reason is, is because the real founder of this city, of Constantinople, uh, is who's Constantine the Great. He took it to sort, of, to sort of decorate his great new capital city. He took it from Delphi, from the Oracle of Delphi. We sort of heard, have heard of Delphi before. He takes it there, brings it to Constantinople, and places it in the middle of the Hippodrome. And that's where it's tested to this day. Uh, one thing you'll notice about it is that it sort of looks like it's missing the top part of it, and indeed that is true. It used to have three serpent heads sticking out from it, and there was this giant golden bowl that it was supporting uh, up on the top of it. What's happened to the bowl? That's an interesting story. That was looted during the Fourth Crusade, amongst uh, one of the more interesting crusades where the Latins from the West came to Constantinople and sacked the city instead of making their way to the Holy Land. Stole the, uh, the bowl uh, from on top of the serpentine column. Also stole all of the bronze plaques that used to be on top of the, um, on the sides of the walled um, obelisk right over there. Serpentine heads, you can still see them in the archaeology museum. You can see one of them, but to this day, I don't think it's getting the attention that it deserves. So I wanted to share this with you. My favorite monument in all of Istanbul, the Serpentine Column.